AI animation has come a really long way over the past year and there are lots of tools available today to bring your animated vision to life. Whether you're trying to animate a picture, do a short animated theme, doing something for work, or just trying to do this for fun, I'm going to be showing you 15 AI based animation tools that you can use today to start your animated project. So let's get to it. These are in no particular order but number one on the list is Animate from Audio from Adobe. This is a tool that takes any audio that you give it and automatically converts it to a complete finished animated story, including doing the lip sync, the character movement, and everything else you need for your animation. To use the tool, it's quite simple. Just head over to Animate from Audio and then click right here to select whatever character it is that you want to use. Then select a background that you would like to use for your particular project. And once you're done with that, you simply want to just hit record to record your voiceover or upload an audio if you already have it uploaded. And once you're done with that, just click on generate. Now allow the AI to do its magic. And before you can grab a copy and come back, you have a complete animated story ready for you to start sharing. Did he say go left or right? This next tool is a fun one. It's a research project from Meta called Animated Drawings. It was created to animate kids' drawings. So some of the animations could be a little bit silly, but it's quite a fun one to play around with. And it can animate any kind of image as long as it's on a white background and it's also in a T-pose. So if you're using an image generator to generate this, just make sure to reference T-pose in your prompt and you should get some characters that are in that T-pose position. And if you want to remove the background, you can use free tools like Remove BG or Adobe Express to remove the background and download it on a white background. Now, once you've done this, just head over to the tool, upload your image. You want to adjust the mask if it didn't fully capture your image. And then next, you'll be told to use a bone to give all the joints of the images. And once you're done with that, you can start animating your images from some of the predefined, very silly looking animations that they have on the tool. And here's a tip for you. For your friend's next birthday, I suggest you get their picture and put it to this tool and create funny animations for them. I'm sure they're going to pretty much appreciate it. Let's move over to the next tool. The next set of tools we're going to talk about are AI image to video generators. So you give them an image and you can prompt them to animate the image in some kind of way. The first tool we're going to be talking about is called Prom AI. The website has a number of features, one of which is video generations. You can do text to video and you can also do image to video and generate very cool looking animations like the one you see right here. I'm going to head over to the left right here and click image to video. You get 10 free coins when you create an account and each video costs you two coins. Once you have it open, you simply want to click on the blue icon to upload your image and then choose whether you want low motion or high motion and simply click submit and wait for the AI to do its magic and then you have your masterpiece. The next tool on the list is called Genmo AI and this one gives you a lot more flexibility compared to Prom AI. You simply open this interface and once you click on video, you have this chat box right here where you can describe in detail the kind of video you wanted to generate or upload an image and describe what you wanted to do in that image in details. Now there are a few settings you can select to choose how much motion you want and how much you wanted to preserve the original image you've uploaded and simply hit submit and wait for the AI to do its work. And there you have it, your masterpiece is ready. Our final tool in this category is called Layer Picks. This is a tool that takes an image and gives it some kind of parallax 3D motion. So you simply open the tool, click your image and upload it and just wait for it to do its magic. So as you can see, some subtle animation has been added to our image and you have several options here to choose how much motion you want, the different kinds of motion you want. You can tweak all of that until you have your images and your animation looking just right. Another neat feature that this tool has is you can export the depth map of this animation and use it on other 3D softwares that can actually interpret depth map. Pretty cool. You're going to need a Discord account to access this next tool that we're going to be talking about because it's currently in beta and they don't have a dedicated web interface. And the tool I'm talking about is called Moon Valley. To access it, you simply just go to moonvalley.ai, click on the try the beta option. This will take you to their Discord server. You have to accept the invitation, fill out a few forms and you'll be added to their Discord server. Now, once you're in their Discord server, you want to go to any one of their channels right here on the left and click on that. And once you're in the channel, in the chat box, just simply type slash and it will give you some of the options that you have. You can do a video from a prompt or you can do a video from an image. If you would like to create a video from a prompt, use the create option. On that prompt section, type in details, everything you would like to see the AI generate, be as detailed as possible, then simply choose a style. They have some few styles you can choose from. And then like some of the other tools we've shown, you can select some of the camera movement and a few other options. And once you're done with that, just simply send it and the AI will take a few minutes and it will generate for you 
your amazing video. If you want to animate an image, just use the animate option and upload your image and just click enter to send it to the tool. Now, the next two tools we're going to be talking about are one of the best two tools in this category. But the big drawback from this tool is that their free tiers are not as generous as some of the other tools that I've shown you in this category. The first one is Pika Labs. To access this, you simply go to pika.at. Now, once you create an account, you'll be given some free credit. And if you look below the screen, you're going to see a chat box. Right here is where you can upload your image or video as a reference and describe in detail what you want the AI to do to that image. And like the other tools I've shown, there are a few parameters that you can change like camera movement, some negative prompt and all of that and simply hit the send button for the tool to generate your videos. One unique feature in Pika Labs is they now have an option to do some lip syncing. So as the video generates the animation, if there are characters, human characters or figures in the scene, they can actually talk and lip sync to the audio that you've attached. Oh my God. I'll be damned. And the final tool in this category is runway.ml. And to access this, you simply want to head over to their website and click on the try gen 2 option. And, and like all the other previous tools, describe in detail what you wanted to do with the image. Now with runway, they have a couple of styles that you can choose. You can choose from 3D character style to different other styles that you wanted to turn the video into. And once you're done with that, there are a few other parameters also like camera movement and the other ones that we had in the other tools. Once you have all of those dialed in, just simply want to hit generate and you have animations that look like this. The best way I've found generating AI animations that actually stick with the exact motion and movement you want from your characters is using an actual video as a reference. So the next three tools I'm going to be telling you about are tools that do AI video to video animations. And the first on the list, they offer a seven days trial. After that, you have to pay $5 a month to use the tool. And the tool is called Kaiba AI. And to access it, you simply go to kaiba.ai, create a free account, and then you can click on the create video option. Now you're gonna be given three options, creating a video from an image, from a video, or from an audio. What we're interested in is the video option. So we're gonna click on that, upload your reference video up to four minutes long, and then it asks you two questions. What type of video are you trying to create and in what style? On the first option, it wants you to just simply describe what you wanna see in the video, in the frame, in the scene. And then the second option is describing the art style. So describe the kind of art style you want the video to have. Simply click continue after that. You can tweak the parameters and click on generate. Once it's generate, you're gonna get four options and you can choose which one of the four options you like and hit the download button and get cool looking animations like this one. So we're gonna need to head back to Discord to access this next tool that we're gonna be talking about. The tool is called Domo AI. And to access it, you simply wanna to go to their website and click start in Discord. Now, once you go through the whole process of accepting it and joining the Discord server, you just wanna to go to one of the generate channels and type the backslash. Now, the option you wanna choose is the video option. You can upload your reference video and then in the prompt section, describe in detail what your video is or what you wanna see in your video. And then they have several styles that you can choose from, from 3D to different types of illustration styles. And then once you're done with that, you simply wanna choose whether you want it to adhere more to your video or more to the prompt that you described, and then choose the length. You can go from five seconds up to 10 seconds for video and just simply send it. Give it a couple of minutes, and within a few minutes, you're gonna have your AI masterpiece. Now, when you join, you only get 100 free credits to use. After that, you have to get one of the paid plan. If that is too expensive for you, then the next tool we're going to be talking about is just right for you because this tool gives you 50 free credits, which are renewed once every day. And the tool we're talking about is called Lens Go. It does very similar thing to Domo AI, and this is accessible from a website. So if you go to their website, lensgo.ai and create an account, you're going to get access to the tool. Now, the option we're looking for once you're in here is the option that says animate video. Once you click on this, you can choose your aspect ratio and then right here on the bottom, you click upload video and then simply choose your reference video. Now, once you do that, you wanna choose one of the models they have to give the style. This model is gonna give a style to your video. And once you have that set in the prompt section like we did with Domo, fully describe what you would like to see in your video or what your video stands for. And then simply click on send, give it a couple of minutes and then you have your AI video generated for you. Sometimes you want to add lip syncing to your videos or do some kind of talking head animations to your AI characters or pictures that you have. 
The next four tools I'm going to tell you about help you do just that. The first and probably my favorite on the list is called DID.com. Now to use it, it's quite simple. Once you open the tool, simply click and upload whatever image you want to animate. And then you can either type a text of what you want the image to say or upload your recorded audio and click on generate and you have your talking head character in just a few minutes. Another tool that works very similar to this is called HeyGen and they work very similarly. You come right here, you upload your image and you can either upload an audio or choose what you want the character to say by typing it and generate. HeyGen does give you about one minute worth of video translation every month and it actually has a suite of other products that it does beyond talking head, including video translation and creating talking heads that actually has movement with your hands recorded from your video. This video you are watching right now is not real but AI generated. Using 11 Labs for the audio and HeyGen for the video. Cool, isn't it? We might cover that in another video. All right, our next tool on the list is called Vizno. And once you create your free account, you simply want to go to free AI tools and click on talking photo. Now you can upload your custom picture or use one of their pre-existing characters that they already have for you. Once you do that, you can type what you want the character to say, upload your audio or actually even have it clone your voice and click on generate. And within a couple of minutes, you're going to have your AI generated talking head like this one. The landscape of our industry is evolving rapidly, presenting us with both challenges and avenues for growth. Our final tool on the list is a tool that is completely free. It's an open source tool. You can access it on Hugging Face. I'm going to put a link to that in the description of this video. And the tool is called Sad Talker. Now, it's not the easiest to use compared to the other ones, but this is completely free. No other marks. The only drawback is that it can be quite slow to run, sometimes up to an hour, depending on how busy and how many people are using it. Now, like the other tools, you simply upload your image and your audio files. And here are some key settings for you to remember when generating your videos. You want to make sure you set your expression scale to about 1.2, 1.3. Make sure you choose a resolution of 512 if you want the best quality image. Set the pre-processing to full and also select GPF and gun. This should give you the best settings you need to generate your image and simply click on generate, go grab a coffee, maybe grab some lunch and eventually your image should be completely done and you're going to get some pretty good results with this. It's just going to take you a bit of time. I don't wait for a hero. I am the hero. This next tool that I want to tell you about goes a step further than just talking head images, but actually add lip syncing to whatever video that you give it, as long as there's some kind of human face in that video. The tool I'm talking about is called Lalamu. And as of the time of recording this video, this tool is completely free to use. Once you head over to the website, you want to upload your reference video that you wanted to animate. A tip for you, it works better if the characters in the video were not already speaking. If they're quiet, it works pretty well. Or you can use a pre-existing video that they already have. We're going to use one of their pre-existing video. And to the left, you can type in what you want the characters to say and select a voice. Or you can upload your own audio and simply click on generate. This is going to generate a lip sync animation to that particular character, even following them across different camera angles. It works pretty well. And then you can right click and save your video whenever you're done. The resolution on these videos are not going to be that great because this is just a preview, but you can use an AI upscaler to try to upscale the video to make it look a little bit better. I know that was a lot, but I hope this has inspired you to get started on that animation project that you've been holding off on for a long time. I'm going to be creating detailed tutorials on some of these tools to show you how you can go in depth into them. So you want to make sure that you're subscribed to this channel to catch those whenever they come out. But for now, if you want to see how to use animate from audio in details to create even multiple characters, that video is going to be popping up right here. I'm going to catch you in the next one. Keep learning.